Yes, people, welcome back to Football Therapy with me, your host, Jan. I do hope you lot are doing well, and welcome to today's video, which is on young striker Tammy Abraham and the three reasons why he is the striker that Chelsea have always needed yet have always had, or at least had since he was a little kid. So I will be going through the reasons why Tammy Abraham could potentially be the perfect fit for Chelsea. And also, he has just come off a man of the match performance away at Carrow Road where he bagged himself a lovely brace of goals. Before we do get into today's video, please do subscribe to my YouTube channel. Hit the bell notifications icon because I'm uploading every day, guys, and I don't want you to miss any content and if you want to help me out please like this video all right before i do get into three said reasons of why tammy abraham is perfect for Chelsea, let's just have a quick talk about his recent performance away at Carrow Road. Abraham had come under a bit of criticism for not scoring yet for Chelsea in competitive games and the poor lad endured some abhorrent racism on Twitter so he was going through a hard time um, and it did look like he might be taken out of the team for a little bit until he gains his confidence up but apparently he didn't need that. He started the away game at Norwich and Frank Lampard said to him before the game today is your day. He laughed about it in a press conference and said it was a bit of kidology but he did approach him prior to the match and try to raise his confidence and because he genuinely believes in this young striker, he believes in his young squad generally but you could tell he wanted to back Tammy all the way and his confidence in him paid off. Two superb finishes by Abraham both lovely in their own right and it shows Tammy Abraham doesn't just score from inside the area. Now in terms of his skill set, ability and goal scoring record, Abraham has scored a lot of goals in English football over the last three years but I'm not going to go through that today. If you do want to watch the video that I've done on Tammy Abraham about his goal scoring record when he was given the number nine share I wanted to show people that he does score goals and he's used to scoring goals. Check out my video on Tammy Abraham, I'll put it in the card above. Maybe wait till you've watched this video or pause this video, whatever, but make sure you watch it. Which leads me on to my first reason of why Tammy Abraham is perfect for Chelsea. Number one, he's experienced in English football. Yes, Tammy Abraham is only 21 years old, but he scored over 60 first team goals in English football. Granted, the majority are in the championship, but stylistically the way English football's played, it's not too dissimilar to the Premier League. Certainly very physical and fast and young strikers have to deal with a lot of different questions that are asked of them. Often strikers that are brought in from different leagues that have done very well around Europe, they can struggle with English football and the physicality and speed of the game. We're talking about endless amounts of strikers that have come in and just haven't fit the bill and can't deal with the physicality of English football. Obviously Morata, very talented and skillful striker, but just couldn't deal with the physicality of the Premier League or English football. He was often on the floor you know, moody, petulant, and didn't really work for him. And also, I'm not going to talk much about them, but Falcao and Pato, ugh, they didn't work out. And Chelsea actually have a long list of strikers that I'm not going to get into, so... Of course, Chelsea enjoyed a good spell with Diego Costa for three seasons, but sadly, for as well as he performed on the pitch, we all know Diego Costa had his problems and often could cause destruction. Tammy Abraham won't cause any destruction. He's a dedicated young professional with a good attitude and experience in English football. He knows the drill. He knows what the referees are like. He knows what the big hairy ass centre backs are going to be like that he's coming up against. He has no issue with the language barrier that with coaches or fellow teammates. And he's watched the Premier League all his life. So in terms of being conditioned for the environment, Tammy Abraham is young and experienced and he's a very appropriate candidate to be a successful striker in English football. All right then, let's move on to the second reason of why Abraham is the perfect striker for Chelsea Football Club. He fits Frank Lampard's system and style perfectly. Sure, we've all heard Frank Lampard's got an incredible belief in Tammy Abraham or all his young players, but we've heard him wax lyrical about Tammy. And that's not just because maybe he's an academy product or he thinks he's a good kid and he's been around him for a while. He suits how Frank Lampard wants to play. Now, I've said this before, I've talked about how Giroud is the experience sort of plan B and you can sort of trust him to play against 
you know, big physical centre backs. I've talked about how Michy Batshuayi is just a really good finisher for all his other in-game faults. You could trust him to score goals if the ball comes to his feet in the area but in terms of how frank lampard wants his team to play tammy's getting better at holding up the ball and he demonstrated that last time out but he also runs the channels and he presses he's tall he's dominant so he can basically win balls in the air and also be good at defending set pieces when chelsea finally get better at defending set pieces but it's his movement like i said it's running the channels it's the tactical movement knowing when to press when to sit back and basically just have high levels of energy. Frank Lampard likes his young, youthful, pacey, energetic team, and Tammy Abraham is absolutely in the mold of that type of striker, yet is just used to scoring goals. That's what he's been doing the last few years. We've seen Tammy can play in a two quite comfortably and press well in the diamond system with a strike partner, but he can absolutely lead the line by himself. He can combine on the break, he can run on the shoulder. His movement in the 18 yard box is very good also. For example, if he's advancing forward when Azpilicueta is getting to the byline, he knows exactly when to drop off and receive the cutback to score. Like his first goal at Norwich, he, he peels off backwards, hits it first time, absolutely lovely finish. That's what Frank Lampard wants from his striker. He doesn't just want a poacher like Michy. He doesn't just want a target man like Olivier Giroud, he wants a pacey, intelligent goal scorer that plays well tactically in his system, and you know what? That's Tammy Abraham. And the third and final reason why Tammy is perfect for this Chelsea side is he knows what it means to play for Chelsea. Now hear me out, that sounds a bit cheesy, but just hear me out. So let's go back to when I talked about how foreign strikers might come into the Premier League and struggle with English football in general and how Tammy wouldn't. But also, they might not romanticise about playing for Chelsea. Chelsea can pay a lot of money, they're situated in West London, the Premier League's the biggest and most glamorous league in the world. So there are plenty of reasons why strikers might want to play for Chelsea. But they're not necessarily the right reasons. Tammy has played for Chelsea since he was a young kid. He's gone through the ranks with some of his teammates actually in the squad at the moment. Won loads of stuff at youth level idolised the big Chelsea players and he's always wanted to play for Chelsea. He's reiterated that through his career when he was at Bristol City, when he was at Swansea, when he was at Aston Villa. He always maintained the dream is to play for Chelsea. The dream! Chelsea have rewarded that ambition with their belief and the number 9 shirt, which is a heavy shirt. But he's kept his chin up and he believes he should be there. And it's more important, if you look at any team in modern football, there needs to be a camaraderie, a belief, a desire to play for that team, because if that isn't there, you might as well get rid of them, no matter how skillful they are. One thing that Frank Lampard is constantly reiterating in press conferences when he was first appointed, right up to recently, he wants to ferment into the journalist's mind, I only want people here that want to play for Chelsea, I want people that are passing through, Obviously, he looks into Tammy Abraham's eyes and says, you've always wanted to play for Chelsea. This is your club. You've been here for years. You've dreamed of being in this position. And you know what? I believe in you. English football has seen Tammy Abraham score loads of goals. He knows where the net is. Frank Lampard sees him on the training pitch. He knows he can play the system. So the ability is there, but the desire, which is equally as important as the ability, is there to play for his club, Chelsea. He will fight for his teammates because his teammates play for the club he loves. Think of the alternatives in world football at the moment. What, Chelsea buy a world-class poacher like Mauro Icardi, who not even tested in English football and again might be another failed a foreign striker coming to the league, but a destructive ego, you know, the character that doesn't help. You want a player who sort of sees this camaraderie, a brotherhood within his own squad and team and will fight for the players and the badge. That's all Tammy Abraham wants to do. That's incredibly important for modern football. That's really important for Chelsea Football Club. And obviously that is very important for Frank Lampard. He's used to English football. He's scored a lot of goals in the championship. He scored some goals in the Premier League. He knows what it's all about. He's watched it his entire life and he has no problem scoring in that environment. Remember, over 60 goals and he's still only 21. Number two, he fits the bill for Frank Lampard systemically and tactically. He wants the striker in this type of mould and he is young, he's fresh, he's energetic and he's got the right professional attitude. And finally, he brings some heart back to the club, which a lot of clubs in modern football lack. 
suddenly there's a unity and there's a belief, there's a core of real Chelsea players in there which is so so important. If you can't buy every Galactico player on the planet, your alternative is putting in a core belief of these players that believe in each other and want to fight for the badge and the club and in this case with Chelsea a lot of them have come through the club even better. A lot of English media want Tammy Abraham to succeed as well because he's a good kid by all accounts but also he's a talented young English striker and the Premier League needs that. They want to see, it's it's superb how the Premier League attracts foreign players from around the world and having this multicultural league is such a, I guess a blessing because it makes it more entertaining but of course as an English league, English country, English club, you want to see some of your own young English academy players coming through because that means you're doing something right as a club. So what do you guys think? Get down in the comments below. Do you believe in Tammy Abraham? Do you think he could be the striker Chelsea have needed for a long time, for I don't know, the next 10 years, 8 years? Get down in the comments, let me know. Let me know if you'd prefer something else or how you think things are going to go with him. Just get down in the comments. I'd like to request you do like the video if you've enjoyed the content. That would mean a lot. And also subscribe to the channel if you are new. And why not follow me on social media, guys, at Football Yannick on Instagram and Twitter, at Football Yannick. All right, guys, I'm off. Enjoy the football. I will see you later. You ain't so tough with that bad boy tuck. I'ma get it how I'm living. I'ma walk the walk. Outline my lines. I rap through thought. Body bag the verse. Outline the chuck. In my life seen trouble, hustle on the double Silence on the trigger like my pick got a muzzle Yo chick like to guzzle, bad boy stay in trouble I only love this paper, sorry I don't I love me baby